So a nest is a basket which equals father, as in a bird nest is a bird basket. The first baskets ever made in the history of the universe were made by the creatures. You know, the bee hummingbird is on the cover of this book, and that's actually my favorite page so far. The smallest bird there is. But um, the bird makes a basket. It's called its nest. It's a weave of, of course, twigs and straw, whatever they want. But look at the correlation between nest and basket, both of which equal father. It couldn't be more obvious. It's just embarrassing. Um, there it is. Just perfect. There you go. And, of course, those parallel the word bowl and cup. Um, sugary is a loaded word. Okay. It equals the father. Very obvious. Beautiful word. Um, so I'm... That's amazing. I'm harvesting gems about the bee, hummingbird, the smallest bird on the planet, and it is amazing. Of course, the word hummingbird goes to father. Bee hummingbird is flawless for father. Um, other words that go to father, glossy, throat, whistling. So related to this word humming, which goes to father, you have other words that go to father, like whistling, twirling, whirring, purring, blowing, singing. Hunging, humming is just singing with closed lips. But all these words go to father, okay? But this is just an amazing, you know, we, when, we, when you say the word basket today, people think of basketball or they think of a man-made basket. Well, the first basket ever made was made by a bird. It's called its nest. <laughs> Birds have been making baskets, also known as nests, for th just over 6,000 years since the creation of the world in six days, okay? A basket is a nest. That was the original basket. So there's a great correlation, a great gem for father. Both words equal father, of course. Um, wow.